Hey everybody, it's Taylor again. Today is Sunday, Sunday, November 22nd. Um, the whole cooler thing has been on hiatus for a while. I've been trying to get some new parts. At this point, it's kind of like the Iraq War a couple years ago. We've spent too much time and money on this to not finish the job type of thing. So, I'm going to finish it, I promise you. I will. And I will let you know when that happens. Uh, until then, I'm still waiting on some parts. I... I got a new mini heat sink to go on the bottom of it. I got... I'm getting a, a new fan. The fan's actually going to be about eight or nine times more powerful than the fan I've got now. And it should be relatively just as loud as the fan I have now. It turns out the fan I have now is uh, not, as, not as really powerful as I thought it would. I, I should have shopped for something called CFM when I was shopping for a fan. CFM stands for cubic feet per minute, which tells you how much airflow that your fan's pumping out. Well, I figured out that mine now pushes out about 17 cubic feet per minute. The one I'm getting in the mail gets about 110 cubic feet per minute, something like that. So, um, it should be a lot better. Um, I'm also... Oh, one other thing. It's a DC fan instead of an AC fan because overclocker geeks that like to mess with their computers make these types of fans and of course computer parts are all DC circuits not AC circuits so I'm going to be getting that here's one video that I'd really like to share with you that has put me to shame there's this guy out in Brazil who did this experiment he used a I think he used a 96 watt Peltier unit just one of them a single 96 watt I'm using <clears throat> three 136.8 watts, which is about about 270 something watts. So he's using a, roughly one third the power I am. And check out what he was able to do. His secret here is really, really simple. There's a ridiculously huge fan on top of his heat sink, which keeps it relatively room temperature. That's all. That's that's his only secret that he's using. Now, granted, that fan is probably extremely loud. That that he doesn't put any of the actual footage audio into the video. He just has it covered with some song. But um, if you were to listen to that, it'd probably be really really loud. He uses a centrifugal fan, which is the same kind of fan you'll find in a leaf blower. So it's pretty loud. Um, I don't want my mini fridge to be that loud. So I'm going to try, I tried to get a silent fan that pumped out a lot of CFMs. And I've got that coming in the mail soon. Um, this would probably be part 15 of the series, but it's not really important, so I'm not going to act like it is, because I'm not really showing you anything. Um, but just uh, keep pretending that I'm going to get this done. Keep keep uh, thinking it's going to happen, because it might. It might not, but it might. I'm working on it. Bye.